Hello YouTube and welcome to Farm Everything episode 13. In this episode I'm planning on making a cow farm and also exploring the nether to find another fortress. And I just thought of something that my sound might be turned up too high. So once I load up the world I'm going to check that. It sounds somewhat loud to me. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, I fixed it. There we go. Ooh, laggy. Run distance. Run distance, normal. Let's try short. Okay, so like I said, I want to build a cow farm today. And that will require a large, flat, grassy area. So, oh. I didn't realize my house was that close. So I want to clear off this layer of dirt right here to my sugarcane farm. So I think I'll probably do a time lapse of that first. And yeah, let's just do it. Here we go. Cleared the area. We need to have to like put those back. I think that was something I did on the other side. Something like that. Well, it looks decent. Yeah, yeah, I think that's that's good. So now that I'm thinking about it, that would be better. Do that on both sides. Just make it a little bit easier to harvest my sugarcane farm. All good. Except that piece. That piece. Yeah. There we go. So the cow farm is going to go in this general area. I might, I might clear out that tree. Yeah, I was thinking of doing a tree chopping time lapse, but I think I only need to chop down this one tree, so... I should do it. And I do have plenty of wood, I think, from the last episode. I think I did a tree chopping thing in the last episode. Now I've got to remember that all my stuff is in my house. Wood. No, do I not have wood? I thought I had a bunch of wood. Maybe I didn't. Well, if I don't, then I can just go ahead and do another tree chopping time lapse. Maybe start a tree farm? No, I live in a forest. I'm good. I didn't I did deforest the forest. So, tree chopping time lapse, and here we go. Yeah, I need to I need to do some cave crawling in some episode. Maybe the next episode will be mining and cave crawling and stuff. Is that's something that I should do sometime. But on this episode, I want to do a cow farm and go to the Nether. So that's the agenda for this episode. Uh, let's turn half this wood into planks. So can we find room for the inventory? 
And I need to drop off some stuff. String. Oh, I don't even have the string on it. I have a spider eye, not a string. Let's see. This one is for skeletons and zombies. Um, where's my plant on? Uh, plant stuff. There, got this too. Slime balls, they like to be here. Okay, now I should be able to make Click and drag. Wait, what? Confused. Oh, right, it worked. Never mind. <laughs> I'm just confused. Okay, there you go. Now I have a bunch of sticks. Sticks. Are there any more sticks? Okay. You can use many sticks to make many fences. Bam, 64 fences. It's more than enough, I'm sure. But I'm not too worried about having more than enough of anything. I mean, this series is all about gathering ridiculous amounts of everything, pretty much. Making farms for everything, so I have way more resources than I need. It's always fun. So let's start the farm there. So it doesn't block the pathway directly out of my house. There's a like two block path between this and the sugarcane farm. How long do I want this fence to be? Probably just go. Um, let's flatten this area out a little bit. Let's place some dirt. Because I want to have a nice large cow pasture with my large amounts of cows. And in case you didn't know, the reason why I have a cow farm is so that I can make books. That's also the reason for my sugarcane farm. But sugarcane farms are easier to set up. Well, I don't know. But. I set up the sugarcane farm first, and now I need to set up a cow farm so I can get the leather to make books. I'm not exactly short on food at this point because I have lots of carrots, but books will be important for enchanting. So that's what prompted this cow farm build. Is that a big enough cow pasture? It's like. Let's go, let's go one further. That's a pretty decent sized cow pasture. Now of course the problem of getting the cows in the pasture. <laughs> That's always the hard part, isn't it? And I need to make fence gates. So I can actually, you know, get the cows in here. Okay, fence gates, my sticks and planks, for planks, just make a few more stacks, I'll need two fence gates, I think it's just one fence gate per recipe, if I recall it correctly, yep, two fence gates, which should enable the cows to, you know, get in, and yeah, I should put it double fence get on both ends. That would probably be a smart idea. In that case, I need to go craft two more fence gates. Like so. Come on, One full stack. One partial stack. I actually used more than half my fences. Wow. I had a full stack of fences. 
So this is a pretty pretty decent sized cow pasture. And now to get the cows. Ooh. Ooh. I just realized that I don't have any wheat. Because <laughs> I never grew wheat. No matter, I can solve that with some bone meal. Where's my plant stuff? Yeah, I already have some bone meal in there. Two seeds. Seriously? Seriously? I only have two seeds? That's okay, I can use bone meal. Though, bone meal has been nerfed in the new snapshots. In, like, 13W04, it was nerfed, so it took seven bone meal to grow a single piece of wheat. Now it's been upgraded back to two or three. But. Yeah, two or three. So, that's nice that it's been upgraded back up. I'm running 13W05B right now. Which. And 13W05, they mostly just rebalanced bone meal and added a bunch of bug fixes. Let's try to grow a few more. A few more. It's just a temporary wheat gathering, because I don't really need that much wheat. I might plant a full crop of wheat sometime. So I'll keep track of these seeds. I'll just pull this wheat in my hand. Oh yeah, I'll need the wheat to breed them too. Definitely should grow a full crop of wheat. How about I do it like a time lapse of bone mealing a bunch of wheat to get seeds and stuff. Speaking of bone mealing, grab a full stack of bones. That should be enough bone meal. <laughs> so I'm gonna time lapse bone mealing and harvesting a bunch of wheat because I'll need it for breeding animals. Go. more than a full stack of wheat, and I have a bit more planted that I'm just going to let grow naturally. So I'm going to go throw my bone meal back in the chest, and then I'll be on my merry way looking for cows. I have like one torch on me. Well that's right, I'm extremely low on coal. I should go find some more. Oh, sometime. Like I said, I'm gonna go on a mining expedition in some upcoming episode. Maybe not next episode. Mm, sand. Yeah. Falling sand is so much fun. <laughs> so I remember there being cows like off. Oh, off in this direction. There are plenty of cows around in various places if I just go long enough. Is it is it becoming night time? This is terrible timing. <laughs> it's like, yeah, let's go find cows and bring them back to my base at night. When <laughs> I'm gonna get them blown up by creepers. Okay, I need to light up this place. 
Yeah, I don't don't want any creepers spawning inside my campaign and blowing it up. That would be no fun. And I noticed that my hunger went down by a few points, so I should eat some carrots. And then I'll be on my way hunting for cows. The sugar cane should be harvested soon. When I come back, maybe? Really? Why did I leave that? There we go. Oh, maybe the creeper blew up the rest of them. Yeah, that's what happened. The creeper blew it up. Uh, the chasm. How far does this chasm go? Can I just go around the other end? Or... Oh, this this cave is like at the end. The chasm? No? No, there's this little gap between them. Interesting. Very interesting. So I know that there are cows on the far end of this desert. So if I go long enough, I will find cows. That. That dirt block is still there. That's okay. I don't mind if there's this random floating dirt block. Okay, I think it was at the... Whatever end this is. It should be... The south end, I think? Which direction does the sun go? Just curious. Not that it really matters much. Goes, where is it? It's going up on that way. So that way is east. This way is south. I'm heading to the south end of the desert. Here's my makeshift Enderman farm. For those of you who haven't seen the last episode, that's my farm to get the Ender Pearls that I need to get to the end. And in this episode, I'm gonna try and get the Blaze Rods I need to get to the end. So before you know it, I'll be you know, getting to the end. <laughs> this this corner is just so strange. So where are my cows at? I, I remember finding cows like all over the place before. But I guess they wouldn't be in the desert, they'd be around the desert. And this desert is humongous. Have I mentioned that before? It really is. I can imagine it being not fun trying to bring cows back across this desert. So maybe I should have picked a better spot <laughs> than the far end. But I'm reasonably certain that there are cows here. There's one. There's three, four, five. Woo! <laughs> cow and a tree. The tree cow. Two of them. I'm getting those tree cows. If they want to come or not, I will have my tree cows. Let's, let's see. Oh, hi, hi, cow. But I want the tree cows. Where are they? I need to turn down my render distance. Tree cow. Tree cow. Come down here. Yeah, you can do it. Hi. Where's the other tree cow? Did you already come down? Is he in our herd? I guess so. I mean, we have four. We can get more than that. Let's go, herd. I will breed you and slaughter you for your hide. Yes. Doesn't that sound wonderful? Hey, hey. Hey cow, pay attention to me. Rude cow. He'll be back. He wants my wheat. See? There he is. Pretty sure. Pretty sure that's him. Oh. Okay. Guess I destroyed that pumpkin last time and didn't take it. Let's go cows. Let's go! You too. I want all of my cows. 
I have enough. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go, cows. Everyone keeping up? Everyone keeping up? Wait, hang on guys, I need to eat my carrots. My wheat is back. Look, 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 it's wheat. Man, you guys have short attention spans. Hello! Swamps are not for cows. You'll be on a farm. Yes. A cow farm. That is where cows belong. Indeed. Okay, I think I'm gonna cross the river right here. I can get my cows. Cows. Hi. Hi, cows. Hey. I like my wheat. I like my wheat. It's it's pretty cool, isn't it? Yeah. We gotta cross this river. Once we make it into the desert, there should be less distractions. Come on, cows. You can swim. You can swim. No, come on. Come on, cow. No. Okay, that cow just wants to leave the herd. Whatever, cow. Hey, cows, this is a desert. Lots of sand and lots of cactuses. Do not hit the cactuses. Unless you want to prematurely become steak and hide. Leather. I could I could use the leather, but I don't want you to die yet. Uh, west. North northwest. There we go. My render distance is too short to navigate by sun, so I'll have to use my internal compass. Man, you guys are slow. You guys come on, come on, look. Look at this wheat in my hand. My wheat in my hand. Don't you want to eat the wheat? Don't you love me? There we go. <laughs> One cow is just... has hearts coming out of his head. Come on, love cow. You can come. You can come. Yeah, yeah, you too. Hi. No, no, you're not paying attention. You're not seeing what's in front of your face. There we go. There we go. We got our, our herd of five cows. I mean, it's an odd number, but we can make it work. We can make it work. Probably one of them is going to fall in the gorge anyways on the way, so... It doesn't hurt to have an extra. Don't touch that cactus. You're dead to me! No. No, you have too much health. Never mind. You're back alive to me again. As long as you follow, follow the herd. Get in the herd. Looking at me? No, no. <laughs> Just getting pushed along by the other ones. This is so long. <laughs> I'm just gonna time lapse the rest of this, okay? And creeper hole. There we go.
think I, I think I need to go take a nap and then come back for these guys. Hang tight, cows. I will be back. I shall return once I escape from these this band of evil monsters. Come on, I can sprint. Really, I can. That block, that sand block, is Enderman. Nope. Well, oh, <laughs> it's like, well, I'm alive, and Creeper blows my face up. Yep. Well, let's see. Let's make sure I have enough dirt to get out of that place. And jump back in the way that I came, basically. Sugar cane still needs to be harvested. Those cows need to be gotten. And there are creepers. There be creepers. Creepers be creeping. I'm gonna kill you with my fists. That's right. That's right, creeper. Wolf, you wanna help? Nope, nope, you just love me. Wait, why didn't that use up my rotten flesh? But I have two. Probably. You know what, wolf? You're dead to me. Nope. You're not, you're not. Never mind. The creeper didn't want to kill you. Hi, zombie. You're cool. Well, that's right. I need to actually get my stuff from the bottom of the gorge. Completely forgot about that fact. Bam. Uh, that only took off two hearts. Mm, let's, let's grab some armor. Armor is getting kind of low. I should repair it. Once this expedition is over. My boots. My boots are down there. Oh, there's iron in the scorch too. Lots of iron. But, but, right now, I need to have singular focus on my cows. Got, got enough dirt to get out of this place. Let's head up to the top. And just tower out. Bam. Back to the cows. To the cows. Seed rotten flesh because in my hot bar. Yay! Hunger. I love being hungry. And where are my cows at? They're in a creeper hole around here. There's one. There's a cow. Yeah, they've been wandering around. Got that one. Got one. I got two. There's the hole. Got. Oh. Oh. Some cow died on a cactus. Now I only have four. I knew it was better to have five. Because <laughs> one would die. Well, don't touch any cactuses. <laughs> That's all I gotta say, cows. You guys are doing pretty well. Yeah, you can totally walk across relatively flat terrain without running into obvious cactuses. You got this. Except for that guy. That guy's just sitting in a little hole. Hi. 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 Okay. You? You wanna, you wanna follow me? No? There we go. Four. I see four pretty slash ugly cow faces. Cow faces? No! 
No, stupid cow. Cactuses are not for cows. Cactuses are for zombies. Whatever. If I can get these two back in my pen, it will be mission success. Come on, come on, cows. No, I can go back for the other one. Let's, let's climb the pyramid. Let's, let's not fall into the gorge. Falling into the gorge would not be a good thing. Okay, I got one. I got one. I got one cow. Out of all the ones I started with. One cow. Bam. Success. Well, mission, mission, half success. Hi, puppy. Partial success. Cow number two. So much easier when you do it one at a time. You're coming. Good. Good. You want to come in the door? Come in the door? No? Come on. Are you even watching me? Do you even... Pay attention to people who eat. Hi. Hi. No. No. Cow. Pay attention. Pay attention. See? See? No. And the other cow left, of course. Of course he did. Of course. Come on. Come on. Not you. You. The cow that is outside the door. Come inside. This is ridiculous. Do you know how to jump up block? Jump up block. Can you jump up a block? Can you please? No. No. Cow. Cow. Pay attention to me. Pay attention to me. Jump up on the block. Jump. 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 Open the gate. Can you can you come in the gate, please? No. Don't go out the gate. Come in the gate. You're so close. Yes. I'm never letting you out again. Ever. Ever. And by the way, you love each other. Yeah, you better love each other because you're never going to escape. You're going to be stuck with each other forever. Yep. And your baby cow, too. It's so cute. Hey, baby, baby cow, look at me. Look at me. It has like the exact same face. The exact same face as parents. <laughs> Whatever. Whatever. Cows. Have fun. Yeah, sugar cane farm harvesting. Okay, I successfully got two cows. I'm not even gonna try and get any more. Because <laughs> having animals follow you is a huge pain. I might as well just breed the ones that I have. You know what? I, c I could go out and find the other ones to kill them for their leather. Because the leather is just nice. I have, I have a decent amount of coal in my furnaces, that's right. And drops can go in there. Let's see. Stone stuff. I'll throw all the non cobble stuff in there. Throw the cobble stuff in there. Um, I'll throw ender pearls in valuables with with slime balls. And then we they're plant stuff. You know, I use them for animals. And then torches, iron. I should repair my armor. 
The helmet and boots are doing the worst. Probably can't repair it all the way because I don't have that much experience. Because I died. But I can at least make it less likely to break. Let's see my pants. Want my pants to be in good repair. Three. Three! Three for one? What? Never gave me that much before. I mean, never cost that much before. Well, I can get experience from stuff. And yeah, I want to have, I want to have well repaired armor to go into the Nether. Maybe I'll just throw this armor in. Let's see, I have. Throw this armor in there, make a new set of armor. It'll be in good repair. I'll use this iron sword to repair mine a little bit. There, now it's in better repair. And I shouldn't need fences on me. Or cactus. Or leather. Leather is well, there is kind of valuable because I need it. Yeah, I already put it in there. I need it to make books, and it's the hardest part to get a book thing. With the recipe that I need to make books. Throw my birch wood in there. I need to bring along. Um, yeah, I have a separate carrot chest. I need to bring along a bunch of carrots. Um, yeah, make myself a new set of armor. That's right. Then I think I'll be ready for another expedition. Well, and I need, I should also bring along a stack or two of cobblestone. Let's see. Like that. Then, what else? That. And like that. Bam. Full iron armor, iron sword, iron to make more tools and stuff. Should I use my iron tools in the nether? My iron pick and stuff? I certainly don't need an axe and shovel. Iron pick could come in handy, but it's it's kind of like super overpowered compared to like netherrack and like I said bring along a few stacks of cobble to build stuff and that should be should be pretty good up oh, up oh. abort take a nap first and now we're ready ready to go out the wrong door yeah okay Here's the door that leads to my old house, which leads to the nether portal. Kind of a convoluted path. But here we go. Into the nether. In search of a fortress. Whoa! 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 So many pigmen right outside my portal. It's a good thing these guys are friendly. I mean, relatively friendly. Friendly until proven unfriendly. You know. And what? I should pick up whatever nether quartz I run into along the way. So that, that stuff could be pretty useful too. So, I'm gonna use cobble as my marker, because cobble doesn't generate in the nether. I can just use cobble to mark my path where I've been. My seat. Oh yeah, there's some nether quartz right there. Let's mine this stuff. Hope I make it back alive. <laughs> shouldn't shouldn't be too big of a deal. I'm gonna play it safe with the blazes for sure. 
torches, cobble. Yeah, I don't want to waste my torches because I'm low on coal. I should, I should be really not using torches. And lighting up the place doesn't really matter because the Nether is a pretty light place, anyways. I mean, relatively. You can see in it pretty well, even if it's not lit up. Uh, well, let's just let's just keep walking. Let's see. Oh, lag. Let's, let's head along here. This looks like kind of a dead end, but we'll see where this goes. Lead to a sheer drop? Maybe? No, it doesn't actually. Okay. I was thinking there was like a one block gap that led down into lava there. It's kind of what it looks like, but it doesn't lead down to lava, it just leads down a few more layers. Let's collect some of this nether quartz. So, I was thinking that this whole nether fortress expedition could turn out to be a pretty long, long affair. So, I'll probably time lapse part of it? Well, not like the first part of it. Probably. I'll, I'll look around for a little bit before I start time lapsing things. Huh. Does is, is this connect? So let's go. No, 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 doesn't quite connect. It's okay, I can make it connect. This is not dangerous at all. Nope. It's perfectly safe. Perfectly legitimate, safe, everything. Okay. It's like torch to say, look up. <laughs> there be cobble. Okay. Uh, another is not, not a very safe place. Okay, okay I, can, I can get down here. Get down here, nice. find some more of this. Nice nether quartz. Cause I figure I'm gonna probably end up making plenty of fancy redstone stuff with this. Might as well have it. Have it on hand. And one more block over there, one more block over there. Okay. Yeah, this stuff is pretty, pretty common. Wait, what? Just one? Okay. There's, there's some gravel. I hear a ghast. I'm lucky I haven't run into any of them yet. They are not very nice dudes. Wait, what? Does this connect around? I wanna get over there. It looks like looks like I wanna be over there. But that will require a little bit of impromptu building it around the cliff. Building around the cliff. I guess now would be a good time to not come after me. Just saying. Because if you came after me right now, I would come back after you with a vengeance from being, you know, pwned into lava. I hear him. Ugh. Ugh. Just, just stay out of my life, gas. I could really use a lack of gas at the time, at the time being. Can't even like see anything down there. I'm just gonna turn my render distance up on the off chance that I might be able to see anything. Anything? Okay, it's it's generating. 
We might be able to see another fortress through this little gap. It's a little gap. The gas shot me now, I'd probably fall right through that thin layer. Oh man. Oh man. This is so not safe. I want to be down there. How, how in the world can I get down there? I can't use water. It slopes up in that direction. I want to get down. Because this, this being up this high is not working out for me because I'm just not getting places. Uh, sneak around the corner, literally using shift to sneak because, oh crap. <laughs> Lag! Lag! Lagtastic! Oh crap! Okay. Ow. I can't even see him. There he is. Oh wait, I hit- I hit his fire charge. Ow. At least they don't do that much damage if you're- you have iron armor, apparently. I don't see him. Ah, is there another one? Yeah, yeah, there is. Get out of my life. Get out of my life. I hit him. I hit him. Like everything is on fire around me. Die! Die! Come on! How are you not taking any hits? Ah! Ah, so much lag! These guys are not fair! I call no fair on you guys. Ah, uh, let me, let me get, wait, I think I killed him. I heard a gas, dust, gas, death sound. Come on. I need to get off fire. Like, not on fire, you know? We need to, we need to get rid of these. Ah, uh, gas. The bane of my existence. I want to go over there, but I know that some gas is going to shoot me, and it's going to end so badly. I think the gas is like right under me now. I'll try heading around a little bit, see if I can aggro him and take him out. Yep. Uh, right. I need to right click. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Yeah, I got a hit. Yeah. That ghast. So dead. I still hear another one. Ah. Ah. Hey, zombie pigman, you want to jump off the edge for me? Test if there's a ghast? Okay, sounds like play. Play. Go swim in lava. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> That's how you take care of them pigmen. Okay, experiment. <clears throat> it's a terrible idea, I know. I'm gonna I'm gonna try and go, go across a little bit. Just a little bit. Just just a little bit. And if I hear a ghast, I'm I'm bolting as fast as I can. Back. Really? <laughs> Want to take revenge for your for your bro by pushing me off here? 
Let's move. Let's move. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Let's get off this place. Bam. Solid nether rack. Nether rack. Nether rack is not that solid. It's an oxymoron. But okay. Let's let's get some of this nether quartz because it's here. Oh lag. Why you spike lag? Lag. Uh. Let's turn that down again. Problem is you can't even see gas usually unless your render distance is up pretty high. And you definitely can't see nether fortresses that are far away unless your render distance is up high. So let's let's turn it up. So look around. Look around. Look around. Okay, can I mine this stuff without getting lag spikes? Please? Probably have more than I need of this now. Uh, I'm, I've collected almost a stack of it. Now you never know when I'll need a stack or two of comparators. They could, they could come in super handy. Eh, soul sand. That stuff is no fun. On the other hand, it looks like that stuff might give me a way down. I mean, the fact that there is something there might give me a way down. My cobble is running out fast. I'm down to one stack of cobble. Yeah, let's, let's head this way. Head this way, this way. This way. And drop to another rack. Just a torch. Yeah. Soul sand. Why you gotta be so slow? Hi, Pigman. What's up? What's up? Another fortress. Okay, at this point I should probably cut to a time lapse and basically just do a time lapse of exploring the nether. And see if I can, you know, find anything. Because this could could be quite a long expedition, I'm not gonna lie. Nether fortresses tend to be super hard to find. And unfortunately you can't just like, you know, throw an eye of ender and find it. Well, I mean obviously you can't even get Eye of Ender until you found one, so... But there's nothing that you can do to find them besides just exploring the nether. <laughs> so, I'm gonna do an exploration time lapse, and here we go.
I explored out quite a ways in the nether, killed a bunch of gas, collected some glowstone and nether quartz. Uh, let's see. We craft this up. No, we can't. We can't. There we go. Craft this up. Got a stack of glowstone. Make two stacks of nether quartz. And I killed a bunch of gas. I think I'm gonna edit in to the footage like a gas kill counter, just because because I I did really kill quite a few. But I think that's the end of my nether expeditioning for today. That's right. I won I once like aggroed a pigman and then pushed him into another. I guess didn't maintain his aggro. That's cool. And, by the way, die. Yeah. No gold. No gold. Nothing? At least I got experience. Oh, wow. Look at how much experience I got. I guess most of that was from mining, because I didn't really pick up any experience orbs from the gas I killed. I was killed them at long range. That's pretty nice. Now I can repair my, my other set of armor. That I really need to because this set is still doing pretty well. I was surprised how much, how little damage I took. And that was on hard the whole time. Yeah. Iron armor is, is the bee's knees. It's pretty, pretty awesome. I don't know why I said bee's knees. <laughs> Anyways. Glowstone and glowstone dust go in there. Oh, no quartz. And another rack, another rack goes in the trash box. Oh, dirt. Next time I'll probably bring more cobble too, because I ended up using quite a bit of my cobble. So I don't know. I don't know what I'll I guess I can go on a mining expedition in this episode too. Because you know I didn't actually find another fortress. It's kind of a shame. And you guys, you better grow up. But actually, I might be able to breed the parents of Venus to not grow up. Breed uh, the parents. Parent cows. There. Yeah. Now I have four. Four cows. Okay, next on the agenda. Mining. Mining a lot. And if I recall correctly from my earlier episodes, there is a bunch of coal that is relatively easy to get at in my cave system pretty close to this entrance here. Entrance? Yeah, there, there's some coal right there. Literally right there. <laughs> Under my old house. So... I think I'm gonna do a cave crawl resource ex gathering thing. Though at first the caves will be lit up because I'll be exploring the parts that I already explored before and just collecting the resources that I didn't really get. AKA coal. This this is a huge coal vein. Usually they're two by two by eight, but it looks like this one is like two stacked on top of each other. I mean, 2x2x4, two by two by not 2x2x8. Two by two by Dude, this coal vein. This coal vein is massive. Like, I don't even... Coal vein, stop. Stop. How am I gonna get out? There we go. Okay. That's that's a big coal vein. Here's another one. This one hopefully won't be big. Oh, it looks like this one is smaller than usual. You never know, it's heading into that wall. Could be going quite a ways in that wall. Or or just one block. That would be two. So that one was smaller than usual. Yeah, looks like there's a pretty, pretty decent one. 
Und so. Next thing you know, I'm just gonna walk right into that lava. Okay. I see more coal. I really, really didn't collect the coal in this place. Uh, let's, let's head into unexplored territory. Should be more interesting. I can get coal and other resources on my way. Should get more than just coal if it's places that I haven't been yet. Here, zombie. Yeah, you never know, I might run into a spawner. That would be great for an experienced farm. Oh. Oh. Would you look at that? A couple of endermen. This is too good to resist. Yeah, come at me. Oh, hi. Oh, wait. Render distance. Render distance! Ah! Okay. Let's teleport to. Oh man, where is he at? Where is he at? Scaring me, Enderman. As long as I don't get stuck in a 1x1 hole with him. That happened in one of my worlds. Hardcore world, no less. Yep. This render distance really needs to be tiny. And zombie, get out of get out of here. Get out. I thought I aggroed you. You come after me. Yep. Yep. Oh, you're stuck. Ha. 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 Uh. Fighting Enderman in caves. It's always an adventure. So you can easily find places where they get stuck, but then again, they can always just teleport out of sight. Okay. Uh, I grow two Endermen that may or may not pop out at me at any time. That's a wonderful thought. Now I have the coal that I need to make more torches. I have over a full stack of coal already. And I really just started this Cave crawl a little bit ago. I've been running into lots and lots of coal. So, but we head down to this. The render distance is on tiny, and I'm still getting lag. Why so laggy, Minecraft? Well, this looks semi-promising. Yeah, it's just it's just leading off into the depths. The depths. Wow. <laughs> the depths is definitely a nice word for this for this scene right here. If I were naming places I would name this something with the word depths in it. 
Okay. Um, well. There goes nothing. Creeper. No oh, creeper. Want to fall off the cliff, please? Can you do that for me? Can I hit you off the cliff? Two of you. Two of you. I have a bow. Shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, that's right. Ah, you have a bow too. That's right, that's right, I can shoot you back, Skelly. What the creeper is that? Where are, where are they at? There they are. Oh crap! Why is it so laggy? Because of the massive amounts of monsters that are trying to kill me right now? Get out. Oh, F1. <sighs> corner. Heidi corner. Get out of my Heidi corner. I don't want your hug, zombie. I want my health back. Don't want any of you creepers. I'm out of arrows. Man. I really did shoot up a lot of gas. Yeah, I don't want to get cornered by a creeper. Get out, get out, get out! Uh. New plan. Get out of here. I'm gonna mark my way back to the depths, though. That's probably facing the opposite way from when I had it before. But in this case, dirt points down. Cobble points up. I'm gonna run out cobble, probably. Lol. Dirt points to the depths. Ew. Okay, so time to ah uh, you. I'm not even gonna deal with you. I'm just gonna get out, get out. Uh, lava, lava. I'm just gonna leave. I'm gonna get out of here. Well, seriously? seriously? I'm gonna burn to death. There we go, there we go. I didn't think I would burn to death. I'm just momentarily touching lava. I didn't think that was a thing. Um, night time. Had to be night time. Get in the house! Okay. Well, I'm going to I'm going to check to see how long the episode is. To see if I should be ended off soon. Yeah, can, you, can you love one of your parents? Yeah. I don't even know. But now I have 5. Now there are 5. Oh, and that one's still in love mode. <laughs> okay. So, so <laughs> I'm gonna go check how long the episode has been and get back to you with that.
and I'll see if it's time to end off the episode. Well, by the looks of things, it is definitely time to end off the episode. How's my wheat doing? Pretty good. I think in the next episode, I'll do a lot of mining and also just farming my animals. There's a wolf in my old house. I should totally tame him. Next episode. So thanks for watching guys. Check out the next episode for seeing me farm lots of stuff and I'll probably farm some ender pearls in that episode and go mining quite a bit. So if you like to watch cave crawling for sure check out the next episode. And with that said, I will see you later. Bye.